hello. Today I'm is we're talking about I've blogged about nettles before, but I'm going to do a little video about them now because they I love them. I really do. They're one of my all-time favourite hedgerow things, and they've got such a bad reputation. <laughs> and everybody remembers them from when they're a child, and they sting, and they do sting. Hence the gloves. Um, but they've got so many like medicinal properties and therapeutic properties they're brilliant absolutely brilliant if you suffer with water retention things like that they're fantastic for getting the fluids moving so yeah so it's a brilliant diuretic but don't drink any before like bedtime because you will be going to the loo all night um we're going we're to make a tea in a minute so i'll show you it's so easy but what else is it really good for it's really good for it's a really great anti-inflammatory so if you are arthritic or anything like that then it's wonderful for it can really help the inflammation it helps produce the production of prostaglandins in the body um urticaria so it is called urtica something or other in latin and so it's brilliant if you have any of those any skin rashes um if you think about what a nettle sting looks like it looks like uh it can you know when you get that red rash sometimes it can look the same as a nettle sting and that could be urticaria especially at this time of year in particular which is springtime is um they help with the histamine in the body so they will help you with allergies and things like that so and they're really good for that actually so that's something else to keep in mind um what other things they're good for your tummy they're good blood build builders they're high in iron um they and the thing to think about them now we're going to make a tea in a minute which is easy but you can also use them for soups salads uh, there's loads of recipes out there i mean people make kale pesto oh, kale pesto nettle pesto out of it um you know there's loads of them and nettles are really you can i even saw that you could buy them in a shop the other day and trust me you don't need to um it's quite early in the nettle season you can even buy them you can air dry them like dried flowers and keep them you can freeze them if you want so that you always have fresh nettles careful they're not in a dog walking park and they've been peed on it's a good thing to think about and also you don't want them too close to a road because otherwise they might they will be absorbing the pollution from the road so try to get them in somewhere that's as unpolluted as possible and doesn't have dog piss all over it. Okay. These are the bits we're interested in, the aerial bits. These are the little bits that sting. Soaking them in water takes that away. Definitely blanching them in hot, hot water, cooking them absolutely removes the sting. For a, for a cup of tea, I mean, literally, that would make a really nice pot of tea, but I'm going to take two of them. There we go. See, lovely nettles. Okay, so literally, I'm, I've got a, a dip infusing teapot. I'm going to put the nettle in there, boil water. So I'm just going to leave it to infuse for five minutes, and then um, and then we'll have a really nice cup of tea. And I really like the taste of nettle tea. Now, if you don't, do a squeeze of lemon, a squeeze of lime. Um, and also, what are oh, the other thing I was going to say is you can get supplements for nettle. Um, which are really good. There, uh, the other th the thing that I didn't say that it is really good for is it's really good for prostate problems. It's also really good for blood pressure problems, um, uh, and for the blood. As I said, it's really good blood builder. You know, so you can get a supplement if you need more. Try try a nettle tea because it is a really. Um, I think you'll be surprised at the effect it has. Also, we will be putting up another recipe or two about nettles. Uh, late, you know. We'll do it around the same time as this vlog. So uh, I hope you've enjoyed it and go pick your nettles with your gloves on and have a nice day.